Hi, I'm Nora and I'm project leader of Planet Hunters TESS. Our aim is to find planets outside of our own solar system, also known as exoplanets. We want to find them to answer questions such as how common are Earth-like planets? How common are planets overall? What kind of planets exist? And could the planets that we find potentially host life? Answering some of these questions not only helps us understand the universe as a whole, but lets us answer questions such as how the Earth formed and what will happen to it in the future. So how do we find exoplanets? On Planet Hunters Tests, we use a method known as the transit method, which I'm going to illustrate using this lamp. So let's imagine that this lamp is a star and that this rock is a planet orbiting around it. When this planet passes between you and the star, it blocks out some of that light emitted by the star. So if we monitor the brightness of the star over time, we will see decreases in brightness every time that the planet passes between you and the star. And that is known as a transit event. On Planet Hunters Tests, we use data obtained by NASA's Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, or TESS. So TESS is a space-based satellite that monitors the brightness of thousands of stars, and we need your help to find the planets within these data. In particular, we want to find the planets that the machine and computer algorithms tend to miss. So if you're interested in finding planets, head over to planethunters.org where you'll be shown an image of how the brightness of a star varies over the course of a month. You then ask the question of, do you see a transit, which looks like a dip in the data. If you do see a transit, then you mark it on using your mouse by drawing a box over it, which tells the research team where to look for planets. If you're interested in looking for planets, head over to planethunters.org to see what you can find. Happy planet hunting!